When I recently received the GTX 1070 for review, I started testing it and doing some benchmarks and I noticed performance figures that were really low and as they shouldn't be. And then I changed some settings in the NVIDIA GeForce Experience panel and I fixed it. So let's talk about how you can fix this really easily and talk about what else you can do to get better performance. Welcome to Tech City, this is Brian coming to you guys today with a quick fix video on how to get better performance with the recent GeForce Experience. Now straight away you want to go into the menu and turn off this share feature. All you have to do is go in there, click that off and you should be good to go. Your graphics card will now perform as it should. One other thing you also want to do if you haven't already is turn off Game DVR in Windows 10 itself. Now another thing that surprised me is if you turn this feature off you'll now no longer be able to use Shadow Play, which I know a lot of you guys will want to use shadow play, especially for capturing gameplay. So if you want to do that, you can turn the share feature on, but just make sure the instant replay is still turned off. However, the unfortunate thing about having this share feature on, even with instant replay off, is that you'll still have a performance drop. I found around about 5%. Though if you have the share feature on and the instant replay on, you'll get around 10 to 15% drop in performance, which was really bad. Not to mention I was getting a lot of stuttering as well while I was playing games. Now why this has happened, I don't know, and why we are the public are beta testers, I don't know as well. I'm just wishing NVIDIA would test these things before they released it into the wild, and we're getting problems like this. I mean, I found people in the comments were complaining about performance, especially one person complaining about 980 Ti performance. This is probably a good fix for that. And I recommend anyone who's having performance problems with a recent update on their NVIDIA cards, turn this share feature off. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick video. Let me know in the comment section below, have you been having any problems with the latest NVIDIA drivers? If so, what? Love to hear your comments as usual. And if you haven't already, hit that like button and I'll catch you in another tech video very soon. Peace out for now. Bye.